Hey guys, I'm Jonathan Occasion, and today we're fighting Aradoc again. Elves just keep coming. But one of these days, they're all going to be dead. And Sinesh will be very fat. And we'll all drink lemonade. It's going to be great. Um, so we're going to find him. Okay. Where the hell are we? Okay, hi. Why was the camera over here? Oh, because you're all over here. Of course. Of course. You know? that. How? How are you even there? You literally can't spawn there. That's not even a place you can be. <laughs> it's amazing. Incredible. Alright, I, I don't understand how you all ended up here. It's very unusual. I assume the enemy are over here, but now I'm not so sure. You know, given how strange antics, but, you know... I don't know what to say. It's a weird, weird day. Weird day. All right, let's get over here. Uh, in fact, let's spread you out a bit. And we have our two aspiring champions units that I rather enjoy. Uh, and yeah, that'll do. Can I? I go up there, I suppose. That works. And then everyone else? I think I'll spread them out. And a little bit more. And there we go. Let's go get them. Uh, let's use Border Clip first. So we can get stuck in. Okay, excellent. Let's go straight for these Glade Guard, I suppose. Yeah, let's try and get in a little quicker. Got to be a little careful of the Wild Rangers. They will have anti-large when they're in the forests. If I recall correctly. Okay, let's get stuck in with you. Right, let's go kill them. And, I don't know, let's start whipping people. Or maybe slicing them? Potentially. Potentially. Uh, let's start shooting him. Okay, this seems to be pretty good news. Uh, more whipping, please. Let's do all of the things. You know, do all the things. See how that goes. Uh, so this is a little scary. Although that's juicy. That really is. Let's get you over here. And... Ooh, I don't know. Hit him with that. It's not the best spot for it, but it's not terrible. Okay, good. Let's get you out of here and go kill their lord. Alright, let's go kill their lord. I don't know why I haven't been doing that already. I should be. I should be. Let's hit them. Uh, I mean, that's just Marauders. Let's give them some mad bonuses. Really want to kill them quicker, too. Alright, how are we doing over here? Pretty good. Pretty good. Um, a little upset these Marauder Horsemen are as bogged down as they are, though. And, and these guys. You know what? Maybe you stay where you are. And you guys can move up. Yeah, our cavalry are definitely having a bad time stuck in here. Oh, that anti large is going to hurt too. Where is my spellcaster? Here he is. Alright, let's lower the leadership of that guy. Okay, good. We've almost killed their boy. Okay, good. Alright, that went well. Okay, good. Go kill them. Uh, you having a good time? Can whip these guys again. Not too worried about the Chaos Spawn taking whip damage. And there goes their lord. Lordy lordy. Yeah, there we are. Alright, let's chase them down. We can chase them down. Mostly things being chased down, isn't it? More melee defense, that'll help. Won't do anything. Just tease him. 
Uh, all right, there we go. That's pretty good. Speed things up a smidge. You know, again, I, I never usually do this or I try and mop everyone up, but given the sorts of battles we've been having, this is such a time saver. You know, usually it is. Usually it makes no difference because, like, the enemy just runs off because I beat them up. Um, but yeah, when there's a thousand armies running around, it's just, it's just got to be done. Okay, there goes Evil Lin. Uh, I'm going to go with experience, even though it's not much. But, like, you know, favor and souls, who cares? We just need to get chosen in all of our armies. So we don't have to worry too much about losses. And you might think, oh, but Oleg has chosen his army. We're still worried about losses. Yeah, but that's because he's fighting four armies at a time. And I'm not exaggerating. The eye opens. Uzul could just get a bunch of experience. Hysteria in the ranks. Enables lightning strike battles when reinforcements are present. And an extra 50% campaign movement range and perfect vigor for all armies. That sounds amazing, actually. Uh, Greater Gate of Corn for the faction leader's army. That lets us get a bloodthirster. Uh, let's go hysteria in the ranks. Like, I know it's only five turns. It might not make the slightest bit of difference. The extra campaign movement range is great, though. And perfect vigor for everyone is amazing. But that lightning strike... You know, if we run it as a bunch of elves, we can just go one at a time, please. And that is huge. So we can go my fortresses. And yeah, they're all dead. And um, Blessed Dread are moving. Mentash just got Constructor. Good for you, Mentash. And let's carry on conquering, which is the lesser known carry on moving. And um, yes, of course, that woman gets a bat sale. It's a carry-on movie. Like, mean, come on. Uh, her bra pings off uh, accidentally, and it lands on uh, lands on Colex Sunita's head, and he's like, "Oh no! Oh, embarrassing!" And it, yeah, it's all, all very good slapstick. Uh, let's get uh, Hearts of Iron. Uh, that'll do. You can grab maybe Chaos Strategist. I mean, him having stand or die is very cool. and Because he, he's going to be on a dragon. So actually, having this guy be Chaos Commander, fighting alongside his boys, probably on a juggernaut, but still, you know, in the heart of the, com you know, the conflict, I think that sounds pretty cool, right? Those are our chosen, of course. I was thinking, oh, they're, they're getting high level. Yeah, they're chosen. Uh, uh, Marauder units get extra armor. I mean, that sounds quite nice, doesn't it? So let's get that. Uh, what is going on here? So Cracker Dorden says it's a Dark Fortress site. This isn't Dark Fortress. I think that's maybe a bit broken, but that's okay. Demon Prince! Demon Prince! Uh, looks like this guy yes. has actually been having a tear. He's taken three settlements since we've just been... Well, I guess we've got three as well. Four. But, like, yeah, pretty good, though. Still quite good, okay? I'm still proud of him. Uh, and we'll go to Crackerdrack next. Oh my word. Hello there. Hi there. There's not much here. It seems like a lot, but it's not a lot. This is going to just mess them up. I don't think Crackerdrack can hold out for very long against us, you know? I think they've already run out of steam. And it also seems like Tomb Kings have been warring warring with them as well. They've been tiring each other out. Now all the demons and chaos are running through. That's perfect. And yeah, you can carry on heading this way. Nice. Um, oh, Boris is back. Bloody Boris. Can you, can you stop? Go home, Boris. Nobody likes you. You drunk? <laughs> Alright, as far as I'm aware, Boris isn't drunk, okay? But like, you know, just... Come on. I serve Kislev. No other. Right. Grooks. He's getting there. He's getting there, guys. We have another army doing another war for us. I can't wait. Uh, okay, so we can take this over. Where's everybody else? Oh my god. Like This is madness. Alright, oh, you're still trying to chase them down. They're really giving you the slip. I think we need to go into ambush stunts. And just chill. Just wait for something to land and then we jump them. You know? That's all I really can do. Um, 
Wound maker? Yeah, please. For God smile. What Mentash do more damage? Oh my god. Huglug, really? Where the hell did you come from, Huglug? He must have been in uh, Nagranath. He must have been who killed uh, Yuan Bo. So, technically... Oh god, they were all starting to get on top of our allies. Um, okay, so what we need to do, we need to kill him and these guys. And then we attack Nagranath. Okay, all the same turn. That's how we get replenishment. My god. My god. And no one else can be improved. My god. Well, it's, yeah, just got to. Oh my god, did you see that? Okay, my plan to go attack somewhere else doesn't work at all, because apparently every single orc settlement has hundreds of enemies in it. Well, our enemies, their allies. Uh, could just lose at Marauder and just run back to Norska. I know it's a pain in the ass, but like, there's so many elves that I need to fight over there too. Um, so I need to I need to get in and get a proper foothold somewhere. If I can get a dark fortress as the first settlement I take, then enemies can just throw themselves at the walls. Like, because I can just have chosen along the walls and nothing will ever get past them. You know, I can fight hundreds. You know, each one of these guys can fight like a thousand orcs. Wouldn't be a problem. So, you know, that's kind of what I need to do. Yeah, I think that's the plan. I'm just going to get out of here. But, uh, honestly, astounded how well that, um... Look at this! Yeah, I'm astounded how well Grimgore's doing. But, I mean, look at this. These are all, like, full armies. That's mad. I thought, like, this was a lot. I'd almost gotten through this. I would have been better to carry on fighting over here. Mad. Absolutely mad. Uh, the attrition is going to be a pain, too. Oh, Hargroth. Yeah, you go, go. You go for it, girl. <laughs> so we got another ore slave. I think we already have one, actually. Uh, on, on Oleg, don't we? Yeah, we do. But hey, another three level ups. So, that's pretty cool. Uh, in fact, he's almost max level now. Oh, crap. Well, he can get Deadly Onslaught. And then what? I go hard to hit? Thick-skinned feels a bit pointless. I haven't even got a load of his magic done yet. I guess uh, quite a lot of his magic. Um, That will allow all of his cavalry to do better. So I will want that eventually. Because eventually he's going to have cavalry again. Probably. But my god. Madness. Yeah, get whatever. Doesn't matter. I get whatever twice. There you go. Uh, Moxia, I think, has all the spells. I don't know why I think Moxia is a lady. Spirit of Morka. I think I'm thinking of that character from um, Borderlands. Okay. So, yeah, I'll just go back up to Yudelgard, I suppose. Ugh. What a pain. What an absolute pain. Also, Yudelgard doesn't actually have a bunch of upgrades, so I can't get Chaos Knights there either. Which would have been a good excuse. But yeah, maybe Archeon just fights through a bunch of these elves and one of these armies could go join him. You know, if I had a couple of armies, I'd be happy taking Albion, but my god, this I was not expecting. It's just absurd. Absolutely mad. So yeah, lo oh, lonely Ogben, we left it on its own. Oh, Poor Ogben. And why didn't I level you up? Oh, this is probably um, that other thing. Mentor that did that. Yeah, you too. Destruction for all. There you go, more destruction. Too right. Um, is he going to be a problem? Probably. Probably will. I mean, 
I don't not take you for a Wazik. Uh, what is the chance of ambushing? Like, it's fine here. I feel like he is going to head towards us. Uh, it's a little scary, this army. This does seem like a proper army that got spawned. Although, he's only level 11, which is a little bit lower. It could just be because he's actually got an empire, so they can actually recruit things that are half decent. Um, I'm amazed they haven't exhausted themselves, like Skaven and dwarfs fighting each other. Yes, my ruinous powers. Yeah, maybe I ambush. If I can, like, ambush these Iron Drakes and everything, I think we'll do quite well. I'm so worried that this army's just going to die now, because it's only Marauders. You know, we only have Marauders. We've got the one chosen, but it's mostly Marauders. The Manticores are pretty cool, but they aren't stacked with, like, armor-piercing damage. You know, it's still a fair bit, and the three of them can, you know, do some good work. The Hell Cannon's useful, taking out, like, Iron Breakers or whatever. So, I don't know. Maybe we'll be alright. Well, there are a lot of flying units they've got. So, actually, our uh, Manticore will be really good at just chasing them down. But I'm a little worried about leaving him on his own now. A little concerned. Oh, dear. Uh, right, let's go back to base. Um, we can level this up. It costs 10k. And now let's think about getting another army. Maybe another Nurgle army. Just because I can. Um, lowers control in an area. There's an extra charge bonus. We maybe want another spellcaster. I don't think I do. Although, I think any Chaos Lord of Nurgle is going to have Lord of Nurgle, won't he? I forget. Well, let's just get Valmir Rugalnus. And he's going to rank 5 first, which we can't get to, apparently. In one turn, that's okay. That's okay. Uh, and we still don't have any Chaos Warriors in the queue. 15% is not very much. Is there a way I can get this up any higher? I mean, local corruption, climate, and buildings. I mean, we've got all of the things. So, you know. So many more marauders in here yet. Christ. Well, I'm glad we can get infinite allies. Well, not quite, because we still need a um, thingamajig. Uh, Legion of Chaos, like us a fair bit. So I can get some Forsaken of Nurgle, maybe. Ooh, Minotaurs of Corn. I want Minotaurs of Corn. And I'm going to say it like that. Minotaurs of Corn. Let's get, um, get another Plague Toad for you. There you go. And, uh, I can get some, I can get the Demon Spew and some Rolica's Bubonic. You know, I could get some, some Nurgly boys. Perhaps. Right, let's just do that for now. But yeah, the fact that that doesn't have better units. Uh, we are getting better stuff here. Maybe some knights. Uh, we never got the knights thing here, did we? No, we didn't. We actually never got the knights thing there. So tell you what, let's... Oh, I might as well get that. We can't move anyway. Silly me for undoing that. Uh, you know what? I'm not, I'm not going to bother. All right, I'm not going to bother. We'll get those toads from elsewhere. You know, or like later, when we have more... Um, more allegiance. Yeah, I'm going to try and get a second Nurgle army. Uh, so let's take Pack Ice Bay. I can grab that, no problem. Gift that to our vassal. Got a manticore, finally. Good lad. Good lad. And let's grab that for extra speed, I suppose. Yes, I desire it. And let's give you uh piercing thoughts of burning. Let's do flame sort of ruin again. Okay, now let's go into ambush stance. Hopefully someone else will try and make landfall somewhere nearby. And we can jump them. And you guys also leveled up. Christ, stop leveling. Alright, ruin a seal, sure. And for uh, Asavar. I wish there was something like Mentor, but for just like normal units. You know? Like our, like, you know, Oleg does a battle and then all of the infantry in the other armies start leveling. Um, I just realized something as well, actually. Sorry, running all the way over. Uh, this one turn. 
is probably going to kill Uncle for Uncle. So I might just get rid of him now. You know, he's only a temporary pyre anyway. Oh, and yeah, let's add melee defense for armies in the province. That'll help this guy. There we go, just got an extra 10% ambush chance. Okay, I think that's it for the turn. Christ. So much to do every turn now. It's getting real busy. Um, oh, enemy fell to spot our ambush. Oh, that's hilarious. We'll lose basically our entire army if we fight this. That's bonkers. Um, so we can get onto the artillery really easily. And we can get onto the iron drakes really easily. And once that's done, there's not really much that can hurt us in melee. It's really just the longbeards and the slayers. But the slayers, I don't think, are going to match up very well against our marauders of corn because they've got the big anti infantry. So they're going to fight pretty much like for like. Yeah, okay, I like this. We're going to fight it. So another thing that's pretty great is these are really high level units. So. Ooh, this all works really well. Uh, let's put you guys into uh, melee mode. And yeah, you can go straight for them. Although, actually, maybe we just have these two go for them. Yeah, maybe that's the plan. Okay, you three. Let's get you over here. Yeah, I swear my control key is wearing out. So yeah, you three go for their gyrocopters. And you guys are going to do the same. All right, you guys, spread out. You can go straight for them, with the help of some marauders. And then, our chosen are going to fight over here. They should do great against all of these guys. And then everyone else can start just getting stuck in the front. Uh, we do a portaglyph on our lord there. So. Uh, yeah, get you up in melee mode. Something like that. Why the hell are still a bunch of units back here? Oh, you're supposed to be group two. You're also supposed to be group two. I think I clicked twice, I selected and then deselected. I think, is what happened there. Uh, you go in group one. And, uh... I guess... I kind of want to go for those long beards with them. I guess I'll throw them in there too. Alright, good. Alright. Let's have them. You guys are already messing up. Cannot believe you lot. I know where. There are long bits. Okay, good. You're in the wrong place. <laughs> Let's chase them down too. Go get them. Alright, this is all going to take forever. That's okay. If we kill everything on the ground, they'll have to... Uh, they'll have to listen. Alright, that's all going really well. You keep chasing them down. You keep chasing them down. Alright, you attack them instead, I guess? You keep chasing them. Okay, let's get back this way. And yeah, I guess you guys can just do that, right? Make sure he doesn't bomb you. Yo, they're really not running, are they? All right, trolls, get over here, please. All right, you guys do the same. Uh, you guys are blocked. So let's just aim for the ground there, yeah? Uh, where is my other, where's my hero? There he is. You can bolster um, our stats there. All right, we're not really doing much here because of the... Um... <laughs> God, this is so stupid. Alright, where are all of my boys? Oh, you're in here actually fighting them. Okay, good. Good, good, good. 
The bombs are going to be a problem. But it does look like we have it covered. And yeah, we are fighting them now. Okay, good. You finish them up, please. Alright, they're starting to struggle. I mean, I would like to kill them, though, is the thing. I would like to kill them. Come on, keep, keep, keep on them. Yeah, I don't think I can really do anything else except chase them down with these guys. Which, uh, not sure will last particularly long time. Oh. Yeah, they're all out. Damn. We got rid of two units, though, I think. I think there's two units dead. There's just a single slayer over here. Who are you chasing? Oh my god, I think he's trying to leave. Oh, that's really funny. <laughs> just punted him across the map. Yeah, slay this. Oh, yeah, that'll do it. Oh, and there's the other um, manticore. Oh, I think I chased the other unit off. I think we only destroyed one unit, gyrocopters. I was really hoping we'd shut them down. Okay. Yeah, that was great. Oh, and it seems we didn't wipe out a single gyrocopter. Well, that's disappointing. Um, but yeah, we did wipe everything else. And this was high-value stuff as well. Which makes me wonder if we actually got a decent amount of levels out of this. Mm, ish. Rank 3, though. We can get armor trolls out of them. Let's get another 100. Grove of Woe were destroyed, which is interesting. Looks like the dwarves are at it again. Oh god, there's gonna be a whole other dwarf faction we need to destroy. Also, uh, the undead and the dwarves both had a huge explosion of units, didn't they? I <laughs> think the dwarves in you know, three places really nearby. Four places really nearby. Bonkers. Alright, Drag Bane Jam. There's a dread mobilizing towards an enemy again. They say that every turn, and yet. The enemy is still alive, aren't they? Yes, they are. Path. Although there's four stacks headed towards them. How could I? God, there's just so many enemies. This is just silly. All right, let's get you over here. My God, this is unbelievable. Um, but if we can get um, Archon here and push through, we can we can kill these. It's not a problem. Not a problem. So, gore-stained robes. Those sworn to the Lord of Murder rejoice in every drop of blood spilled. So, extra allegiance with our corn friends. Uh, raid the monolith of Thro Throthrax. Yeah, that's probably not going to happen, mate. Although, actually, maybe it will. I can't want to take Crackerjack, though. Yeah, their capital's right there. Uh, how many settlements have they got? I can't even diplomacy with them anymore. Because, you know... They have three settlements. Interesting. Okay. That's happened. I wonder if they're ambushing us. No, they're not. They're fleeing. <laughs> yes. uh, right, let's get them. Nom, 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 nom. Delicious settlement. Uh, I actually want to take this. And... Okay, yes, this is a proper thingamajig. World. Oh, it's only tier one, which is depressing. I guess I'll go growth. I need to bolster this up as quickly as I can. Uh, blade shield. Lovely. And over here... So, this guy had a wonderful time. Uh, there's some stuff here. I feel like I could have wiped these guys out if I just stuck around the battle a little longer. Um, so what is in Grum? Drakaz. They're mostly dwarf warriors. Mostly dwarf warriors. Now we got that maxed out now. Alright, Infernal Champion. Deadly Blade. I need him to get over the dwarf's really high. Um, spell resistance isn't going to help much. Hellblade isn't really going to help much. I mean, Corn Corruption might actually be handy. You know, it would be nice to actually spread that. But yeah, I need to get over the dwarf's really high melee defense. So I need, I need decent melee attack. Um, could get more manticles. 
Let's talk about the doggos for more manticles. I think they do. <laughs> you fool. <laughs> Not the doggos. We've got to get to the giant. Who do I swap for a giant? I'm not sure. Maybe I swap out a manticore for a giant. Because I do want all these guys to keep keep progressing, don't I? Uh, we need to get to rank 5. Yeah, giant would be good. Oh, I can upgrade you guys. Armor trolls. Hooray. Definitely won't get rid of them now. Alright, I overdid it with the manticores. 4 is the correct amount of manticores. Although now I can't run with a hell cannon, but like giants, like giant, only 1% chance of them filling up. And we got one. So, you know, I want to get that. Now, if I take uh, Grand Drakas, uh, that's for the Goromadni tribe. Interesting. And so all, so is all of this as well, which is interesting. Uh, where do I get the... I have no idea where the capital is. I think it's along here. So it'll be a long time before I can actually gift that to them. But yeah, I think I think the plan is to besiege this place. I think that's the plan. Pyrrhic victory, high casualties, but like, is it though? You know, I don't think it'll be as bad as it thinks. I think we'll probably do quite well here. Bit of a rune lord, which is kind of fun. But no, I think I think we can handle this. I think we can probably handle it. I mean, it's mostly gyrocopters, which I'm going to be chasing around with my absurd number of manticles. You know, just have one going on on the, you know, on each one. I could jump on the walls and kill a bunch of dwarf warriors, actually, you know, allow the warriors of corn to get up easy. I mean, I've got options. Yeah, all right, let's do it. Okay, so I assumed it would be a siege battle, uh, judging from the size of the garrison. I didn't realize it was a... Um, well, not a siege battle. Uh, so that's cute. It's rather sweet. So, get our armored trolls out in front. Look at the climate here. How gorgeous is this? Just like the coloring and everything. It's, it's really nice. It's really frosty. Not a, not a part of the map I ever see, really. Yeah, really, really nice to see. Uh, our chosen in the middle, of course. Uh, you not. Line up. Our uh, Drupid Bergberg. Yes. Drupid Bergberg. Uh, ooh, that's a good point. Can I afford to hang about? I kind of can. Nice. I love hanging about. Alright, uh, long beards. Suppose I can kill some long beards. Nice and early. That's nice. Uh, oh, you're not in the in the thingy. All right. Who's aim for that? Perfect. We're now going to get some artillery from over here, but like bolt throwers, who cares, right? In fact, <laughs> let's get manticles over here. What a curve that was. No. Thanks for waiting. <laughs> uh, I discovered those quarrelers because they really like. Okay, they're coming for me now. They're coming for me. I had enough of my antics. All right, twenty seconds. Yeah, we'll go get. We'll go get them. Amazing. God, just look at this. <laughs> Alright, a couple more seconds. Yeah, let's kill that lord. Nice. Alright, let's go for this gyrocopter. Can I reach him? Hard to say. Alright, let's ignore the gyrocopter. Kill this rune lord. And I go for the iron drakes too. So the only problem I have here is um, a locked group is going to try and target the gyrocopters. 
which is very annoying. Yeah, that's what I'm always saying. Oh, come on. Let's just go get him, yeah? Ice cream! Ice cream will come! He loves his ice cream. Just loves it. Loves his ice cream. Okay, how are you not fighting him now? How are you all just sat there? Absurd. Alright, and back to you. Uh, let's get some of these guys in. Stay on you, please. Okay. Uh, oh, I don't know. Try and shoot them. All right, how are we looking? Pretty good. All right, you're dealt. With, you've dealt with them. All right, let's have you fly up. Because that might trap them. Not quite. It's all right. Go for him now. <laughs> you keep chasing them, lads. You keep chasing them. Okay, what is going on over here? I don't I don't understand what on earth is going on over here. How did we let them slip through this much? Very strange. Oh, you go for them instead. There's some marauders. Yeah, I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> you keep chasing him, I guess. Alright, come on, guys. There's so many of you. I suppose we're manticores. Not boiticores. Get it? <laughs> it's very clever. <laughs> oh, rude. Okay, well, this is a problem. I really don't understand what this weird thing is they're doing. Oh, well, we just hit all the guys who were trying to bail them out, which is interesting tactic, of course. Not so many. So many gyrocopters. Where are they going? I don't understand where they're going. Oh my god, how are you still alive? Oh, you go for him. I feel like so many of our units have just given up. <laughs> Where are they going? Don't understand. So peculiar. I still haven't killed him either. Alright, go chase them down, I guess. Uh, Alright, you guys are doing pretty well. But I don't like that the gyrocopters are actually shooting at us. You know, that's a problem. Yeah, give us pudding. That's what they're, what they're shouting. Pretty sure. Uh, do you want to kill him? Come on, you got a giant. Ooh, that'll, that'll be helpful. Alright, I need to get you guys out of here. Let's just, let's just run you away. Alright, let's run you away. Let's just kill everything on the ground. Alright, we'll chase them off. I still, I do not, I do not understand what they're doing. I still have no idea what it is they're, they're attempting. It's really strange. Are right, you spread out. Right, so how is that guy not dead yet either? Alright, let's head over there. Alright, let's kill him. Alright, let's just get over here, yeah? Come on, let's tear through all these, you know, land dwarves, as they're called. And gyrocopters are so frustrating. Oh, we've almost gone, you know, we've almost gone. Oh, we killed their lord, so that's good news. Alright, and then everything else gave up. Good, good. There we go, we own the place. 
Okay, loads of rewards. I do like a reward. And uh, this settlement is ours. Uh, I could occupy all raise or sack it. Yeah. Ooh, I'm not sure what I do either. I like any. So, I'm going to occupy it. Because, you know, got a modern And I can just give it to the Ashley. Which I think be is uh, wise. They will be dominated. Okay, let's have a look. Deadly... No, Skull Crusher. I want to get into the, the crazy... Crazy ones. Physical resist for all of our boys. And then heroic killing blow. Beat yourself as a treat. Um, let's get you Deadly Blade. Uh, kill a bunch of people. Got a Chaos Chariot for Doomheimer. Well done. And uh, now. Enter then. Uh, wait, hang on. What's it called? A fist fight or both. Grung Drakas. Alright, Grung Drakas. There you go. Give me money. Thanks. I submit. Good. Alright. And now we can sit tight. Uh, so there are more. Oh, hang on. This is a dead end. Wow, that's really cool. I actually really like that. But, you know, there's this, like, they can hop over wherever they like, but, like, this is an exit, I guess? But, like, yeah, it's just deep in the heart of the mountains. I really love the old world, like, mod map for that. They do a really good job of it, making, like, twists and turns, so, like, terrain is advantageous. There's less territory in the mountains, but they can leave the mountains much easier just because of how their factions are. It just never really makes any difference that, like, the dwarves can use the underway when everyone can just walk along all the mountain paths anyway because there's convenient ways in and out the mountains everywhere. Um, you know, it's just... Yeah, this map makes use of um, twists and turns. Uh, speaking of twists and turns, we can catch this idiot. Boris. I just realised, because we're going 190 movement... The line for March Stance is actually further back than our normal, regular movement. It's getting slightly absurd, isn't it? The distance we can travel. But man, thank Christ we can, because this map is gigantic. Okay, close victory. We'll lose a troll. Really? I don't want to lose a troll. Ugh. <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like we just lose one anyway. Like, cause I mean, are we ever gonna gonna get anywhere if we don't just throw the odd unit away? It's only a troll, you know. We can get trolls. They're easy to replace. In fact, I could replace with something better. I could get some flamers, or I could get cockatrice. You know, get another hell cannon. Plenty of stuff I can get. There's there's more impressive than trolls. Or we could get trolls. You know, getting some flamers in this army would be pretty cool, but. I was thinking a cockatrice would be cool. I like cockatrice. I think they're a cool unit. I think they're cool. And you can't stop me. Uh, Blue Scribe's got a student. Oh, God. Got someone else to write all their terrible business. Uh, let's get Purple Sun of Xerius. Because we're getting real Xerius now. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha. Let's grab that. It might make a difference. I don't know. This agency stuff, you know, it's whatever. Okay. Valmir. Let's get more trolls. See, I told you to get more trolls. Um, Alright, let's get over here. Hopefully in this spot, we can get a bunch of knights. Hopefully. Hopefully some knights. Or some cows for something. Something that isn't trash. I mean, I guess I can get more of them. I get manticores. Okay, no, no knights. Fifteen percent chance. We've got nothing yet. Oh dear. Well, at least we get marauders. Actually, we can't get our marauders from here. So I guess I can do that. So Nurgle, uh, just his standard, standard marauders. Not great weapons. We can make them Nurgly, and uh, I can upgrade them into. Nurgle spawn one of these days. And the trolls will need upgrading. You guys just find how you are. And, um. I mean, do we get a hell cannon for him too? So everyone gets a hell cannon? Get a demon spew to lead our Forsaken. Um. Get a couple of horsemen. And then we're gonna make a horseman Nurgly. Okay, good. And then. 
We don't have much space left. I just realised we can't get any more exalted heroes yet, can we? Sure can't. Um, yeah, I don't know. Alright, another... Another Manticore, because Manticores are fun. Alright, the last two are going to be demon units that we nab from an ally. For chaos. Alright, good. You can keep heading down there. I'm glad I have some chaos warriors at least. You know, something that can really hold the line. Okay, so there's <laughs> just elves everywhere. These ones came from over this side to come and join in the fight. Um, there's another four armies here. Five. Christ. Attacking um, Scarbrand, who doesn't exist. I don't know where the hell his armies are. I have no idea. I don't know if there's a like an ultimate cap um, as to the amount of armies that can exist. Okay, Beast Flayer Lodge potentially has more. It's quite a long way from there to there, though. But that potentially has some chaos warriors for us. Potentially. All right, Oleg, he is on his way home. Right. Okay. Uh, a lot of stuff going on over here. That's, um, five more armies. Six. There's Catra as well. Seven. Alright, so that's seven. Eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen elven armies. I mean, I've got two armies, so we should be fine. <laughs> Christ. Alright, let's get over here so we can get rid of Val now. Because he's on his own for some reason. And uh, I can run up here. Um, yeah, with you. And hopefully jump one of these guys. If I move here, I can either attack, like, Pack Ice Bay or that way. Uh, I'm going to move here, though. Yeah, I'm going to move here. Because. Which I say that. I mean, Pack Ice Bay probably going to get taken here. This guy might. Be able to defend here? I really don't know. I don't know what his plan is, to be honest. Maybe not occupy. Defend target. I can't tell him to defend his own base. Can I tell him to just defend Shgold? And I can tell him, but that help be helpful anyway. Probably not. Take that guy, I guess. Christ. Okay, let's get our research going. They've got slaves to darkness. Allied recruitment cost down. That's actually massive, and that's for everybody. I completely missed that one. That's fine. And, uh, gifts. Did we get any more? No. Which makes me wonder, why haven't I done that yet? Let's get more corn gifts. Okay, so, we're at the end of the episode again. We're a little over again. Um, we're sort of resetting in Norska. But, we are making progress in the mountains over here. And, kind of in Gislev. Kind of. So, progress is being made slowly but surely. I mean, progress is pretty quick in here, actually, with our two armies. Like, they're taking a couple settlements per episode. Well, ish. Maybe not. They're taking, like, they're taking territory, it's fine. So anyway, guys, if you're enjoying this, then please do comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys. No man, no god, no creature can challenge me!